when I when I think of Oakland for my generation, I think of a, a, a young mouth and you. Y'all paint like the best picture. No disrespect to Richie Rich and right. delinquents and none of them, but uh, I felt like y'all niggas paint like the best picture of Oakland like ever. Yeah. Y'all niggas make a nigga wanna go to go get it. You feel me? Right. In Oakland. Yeah. I, um, I try to too. I try to I try to paint a real vivid picture. If you're from the town and then you hear me you know exactly what I'm talking about and uh, what I'm getting at, you know what I mean? If you're not, and uh, you're on the outside looking in, you even going, you even, you know, yeah. If you got somebody to translate everything that I'm saying and what's going on, if you don't know, then you're gonna still be able to see that picture like, oh, okay, yeah, all right, you know? Cause uh, that's the only how I can, uh, that's only how I can spit it, so, for, so, so a motherfucker can relate, you know what I'm talking about, to what I'm saying, you know? And I definitely want you to be able to relate to it, you know? Yeah. Okay, so uh, at some point you get shot the first time. Right. It was some bullshit. Um, I tried to come out the cut and try to rob us one night. Uh, and it was just like... I don't know. I did a show in Tracy or somewhere. And I, I was coming back to my car, getting dropped off to my car. And when we pulled up, it was like some little young niggas was waiting for a nigga or something. But we were slipping. I'm in the passenger seat of my car, parked across the street. And uh, I'm high. I'm in the car looking down. I ain't even tripping. You know, when usually I'm on everything moving. I'm, in, the, in every mirror and looking, you know, it's three, four in the morning, we in the east, you know what I mean? Long story short, motherfucker opened the door, boom, the door was open. Motherfucker opened the door and had a hammer in the car. You feel me? He caught a nigga off guard, you know what I'm talking about? To where, you know, for them, shit didn't go according to plan because it was four of us in the car. Who the motherfucker who opened the door was thinking it was just me and a driver in the car, but it was two people in the back seat too. So once he re once they realized that, and then there was another nigga on my side behind the car. So the person that was behind me, he jumped out the car. They jumped, they opened the driver door up and put the hammer in the car. So the person behind me, he jumped out the car, boom, and ran. So the motherfucker on this side started shooting. So I'm like, oh, I ain't knowing if it's, because I didn't know nobody was on this side. So I don't know if this nigga starts shooting. So I open the door. As soon as I, I come out the car, I get hit. Bam. I'm like, oh. So I come behind. I come from, try to put the door, try to put me in the door in between the nigga that's shooting because I already got hit. And I make it to the motherfucking yard where my car at. And the niggas ran, you feel me? But long story short, I had some money on me and everything. They didn't get no money or nothing. But it was just like, damn. It was a, a robbery going bad. Because, you know, hell, shit started happening. I know these niggas was probably just expecting it to just be two people in the car. And it was just going to be him with the gun on us. And a nigga just give it up. And a nigga get out of there. But when all that commotion and shit started happening, and shit just went haywire on the niggas. And, you know what I mean? And that's what happened. And I, you know, I got hit. But, uh, yeah, it was some bullshit that night. I, didn't, I still didn't understand that shit, but I know a nigga was slipping. You know what I'm talking about? Uh, you know, dude from the morning, motherfucker, supposed to be a little more on, on top of his shit than we was, you know? But, uh, that was the first time, you know? Yeah, so the second time, uh. The second time, uh. Another night I did a, I did a show in Oakland <clears throat> and I went to uh went to the casino and I started gambling and shit. And um I come out of there, I lost that night too. I come out of there at like four or five in the morning. I had been in there since twelve and um I stopped at the gas station and um I'm slipping again. I ain't. I'm. I ain't not worrying the world. And I'm in Richmond. You know what I'm saying? I ain't even thinking. 
that the motherfucking car I'm in, they from North Richmond somewhere. Yeah, I'm talking about the car I'm in. The person that owned this car is from North Richmond and I'm in the South, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> and like I say, not a worry in the world. I ain't looking at my mirrors or nothing, but the motherfucker who got up on me had to have seen me park, got out, crap up on me, got up on the car, tried to open the door, but the door was locked this time. So when I heard the handle go, boop, I look, and I'm like, and it's like, pop, 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 motherfucker started busting through the car, you feel me? I don't know if they was spooked or they thought I had a pistol or what, you know what I mean? I don't know. But I know I must have startled the motherfucker who tried to open the door because he just started shooting. You know what I mean? I couldn't even get a good look at who it was because it was gunfire when I looked. And the first one bust the window and grazed my face. You know what I'm talking about? Psh. So it was just like, it made me do this, you know? So I'm getting hit all in here. And I got hit all in my arm like three or four times in the arm. And I got hit all in here. I got hit in the chest. Like right here. And all in here. It's a bullet still right here. That's the one. Because instantly I couldn't feel my legs when I got shot. I tried to drive off and it was like I couldn't even feel my fucking legs. I was like, oh shit. I couldn't feel my legs instantly. You know what I mean? I'm like, damn. I had already put the car in drive so I'm, the car just rolled. With some white boys in the car <clears throat> next to me and they ran on the side of the car opened the door and pulled me out you know what i mean all i remember i was on the ground and then and then it hit me like damn a nigga just shot me all the time you know what i mean i'm bleeding and shit <clears throat> i started praying i was like man damn god i can't die I'm like damn don't let me die god and i said to myself i said uh I said, ambulance, hurry up, ambulance, please hurry. And I looked and the ambulance was coming. You know, they bounced out, turned me over, cut my, started cutting my clothes off of me. And um, <clears throat> next thing I remember, I, I guess I went out, because next thing I remember, I woke up, I was at high in the hospital, you know? But yeah, man, that shit was crazy. That was some crazy shit. Crazy. And how as close as I got to dying, I thought I was gonna die. What'd you say? I was gonna say, how much therapy do you do? Do you still do therapy? Yeah. I um <clears throat> I go like three, two or three times a week. You know what I mean? Uh, right now my body just kinda stuck in a sitting position. I'm stuck like this, you know what I mean? So I've been having to stretch out, I've been having to flatten my body out because I can't even stand up if my body like this. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? It's like my body is stuck. It's like in this sitting position, you know? So I've been doing a lot of therapy on um, just straightening out. Even when I try to lay flat, my legs do this. You know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. I'm making sense? Yeah, it's like stuck. Yeah. My shit, I'm stuck like from, I got shot and I was sitting down. So I don't know if my body went into a defense. Oh, so yeah, it hasn't straightened out since then? No. For the most part, I'm um, I'm getting I'm getting better, man, at, at, at a lot of shit that I couldn't do or that I wasn't doing, you know? You know, and then it, you know, this shit was hella depressing, you know what I'm talking about? It had me like, fuck, you know? snap out of that shit like fuck it I mean I'm alive you know what I mean shit that's the, the best thing you know that a motherfucker can hope for a man's life you know if I wasn't here I wouldn't be feeling none of this shit you know exactly you, see, you probably got a lot more shit to do too right I just was thinking like damn I gotta go through hella pain I gotta fight through this shit in order for me to stand up and you know, work the wrong you ever uh, you ever seen the documentary The Secret um, uh, but I've heard, I heard about watch that, that shit. Yeah, the it's, secret. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, nah, for real, like watch it later on, bro. Yeah, okay, yeah. Watch it. It's, it's, it's in the mind, you feel me? Okay, yeah.